Hi everyone, welcome back to Blueprint DIY. Angelina here, and today I am here to answer the age-old question, can a woman have too many clothes? Well... Nah, psych. I'm not gonna answer that question because I don't want any husbands watching my video talking about Blueprint DIY said you can have too many clothes. It's not gonna happen. I'm not gonna do you ladies like that. However, I have a predicament and my closet is in fact overflowing. So I have to, when I created this channel, what I was supposed to be doing is thrift hauling, recreating, and selling stuff. So I am, I don't like to sell stuff. I really don't, you know, asking people for their money and stuff like that. I just, you know, I'm not big on that. So when I first started off a couple of summers ago, I gave away a lot of stuff. I really enjoyed that. And I was at a different place in my life and my finances back then. And I can't currently, as much as I would like to just give this all away to you guys, uh, I can't currently do that. But I did want to come by and let you guys know that all of this, in addition to more stuff, is going on my Depop page. Some of the stuff is already, a couple of things were already on there. But if you go to my Depop page right now, all of these things plus much more will be on my Depop page. And don't worry if you have not downloaded the app and you want to kind of see what's on there before you download it on your phone, um, you can also, I'll leave the link to the website where you can check out what's on my Depop page before you download the app. So let's get started because this is going to be like, thrift haul style but it's going to be the fastest or the quickest moving thrift haul ever because there's look i mean like a lot of stuff this looks like a low-end retail store as close as these hangers are together so we're going to get right into it um first i have this foreign exchange red faux leather jacket with the tag still on yes i bought it retail not from a thrift store we're not going to talk about that next a chicago t-shirt and I am from Chicago, but it's too small for me. So next, a limited um, jacket, gray and white, and has three quarter length sleeves. Next is a uh, like snakeskin white or cream snakeskin top, and it has a high low with a with a tail at the back. And this is something that I um, redid a while back. Then, and all this stuff, I have had it folded up um, and put away because I've been trying to do this for a while, but I have to. I have to bite the bullet and do it. Like, y'all can tell, I guess, that I am a pack rat, a hoarder, <laughs> but I'm trying to change my ways. I really am. Uh, so, it's this trench coat, so I have to still press everything and get it ready to get shipped out. But, um, it's this really cool trench coat. And I'm actually, this is already was on Depop, and I've gotten a lot of likes, so I'll probably reduce the price of it so it'll sell. And then I have these original tops still on my Depop page, so if you guys did did not know that they were for sale they are for sale on my depop page and i have them in white and also in black okay let's see then i have this vans t-shirt and also have this lululemon um reversible you can wear it either way this side up or this side down and it is actual lululemon Okay, so next up is my Gordon Gartrell color um, Cosby Show or Different World top. And actually, when I pulled this out of the thing, I didn't remember remember putting it in the bin to be sold. So this might make it to Depop. It might not. I don't know. But it's currently on its way there um, as of today. Then I have some joggers, uh, distressed joggers, and a really cool acid wash that I did. Um, I don't even know if I showed you guys these on, on a video. Then I have my distressed top from, mm, was it last summer or summer before last? But I redid this one and it is ripped in the back pretty darn ripped I actually love it and this was another piece I don't remember putting in the thing I must have been having a, like a moment when I was putting all this stuff in there but 
moving, we're gonna move, I'm gonna move, move forward. Um, this is a cold water creek um, orange or like a burnt orange sweater. And I really like this one because it's kind of built like a jersey or a bomber jacket. Then I have a vest with uh, flag patches and star patches on the front. And I really like this, but it's just a little bit too, it's too big for me. Then I have a BB, where's the tag? Oh, BCBG, I'm sorry. It's not BB, BCBG. Um, lace short set, it's a uh, romper and it's like, See through at the uh, shoulders and then covered up at the bottom, and that's too big for me now. Then I have don't do it. Then I have my members only jacket, and actually, you guys are not gonna believe it, but I was at the thrift store the other day and I found another one. So I have it in light gray and dark gray. Then I have my poncho style um, like pullover jacket that I redid some time ago. Let me cut some string. Um, that I redid some time ago. Then I have this red Land's End jacket. And I have my Diane, bleh, Diane Von Furstenberg. Um, I don't know, this is a taupe color blouse. It's a vintage blouse. Then I have that vintage um, green and white top that I thought I was going to try. Trend that I thought I was going to try, but nah, it didn't. <laughs> I never did it. And then I have my Hawaii um, see through. Like this is kind of see through. You can see the pattern through the jacket. Then I have my blue um like really a, i love this color blue um vintage blazer that i wore to youtube creator day and then also underneath that i have this um really cool blouse that i made uh off the shoulder um that i got from thrifters anonymous so now it's an off the shoulder blouse then i have this um adidas vintage adidas Come on. that I recently thrifted I thought it would be cool to sell it all right let me move on this side and then I have this bomber jacket that says the American Roll House and it has really cool graphic on the back that says the American Car Club then I'm actually going to sell my silver bomber jacket that I didn't uh, put the patches on because you guys know I have enough jackets. I really you can only wear one jacket a day. Um, then I have this green, um, what is this, Joe Fresh jacket. Then I have this black duster coat. Um, it's by Donna Morgan. It's a size four. And then I have um, this military style jacket, um, black. It's just three quarter length sleeves and it has a tiger embroidered on the back then i have this black lace bomber jacket that i'm actually going to sell i've had it for a while um but i'm actually going to sell it because i don't grab it to put on enough so i'm going to go ahead and sell that and then i have my tirade of tan jackets that i'm going to show you the first one is this um tweed kind of cool vintage um blazer then I have my faux leather tan, um, it's short sleeve jacket, or you, I've worn it as a top before, um, especially in the winter time. Um, it can be quite nice or fall time. So yeah, that, that. Then I have my Isaac Mizrahi for Target, uh, three quarter length short trench coat. Then I have my um, Gap. Uh, sleeveless trench coat and this is from the this was the very first uh, coat that I took the sleeves off of you guys remember when I went through that phase I was taking the sleeves off of everything 
and then this one I took the sleeves off as well and it is this one has a little bit of shimmer it's like a trench coat short trench coat but I really like the back of it it has a little flap and the um, pleat there so I really like that and then I have these orange like they're a, like a really nice color orange kind of flowy pants they're tapered at the leg a little bit tapered not too tapered um, at the leg and this is what they look like in the back then I have um, my A plus off the shoulder top that I did this summer and actually all of the except for one the yellow and black one is not on there but all of the off the shoulder tops that I did this summer have been on my Depop um, site um, so you can go by and check those out if you like any of those and then um, also this is one of our challenge items that I'm selling because I have like really enough denim jackets but this is a lightweight jacket and it is distressed um throughout so that's really cool so i have quite a few of these jogger style pants and these are just a really lightweight pair um crystal pair i don't know what that is uh but i really like these but i think they are for somebody that's smaller than me and then i am selling my these other they're like the orange ones but these are teal and they have a little bit of a tapered leg. They're very flowy um, pants, and these have pockets. I, can't, I don't know if the other ones have pockets, but these have pockets. And I'm gonna put, you know, on Depop, there'd be multiple pictures of everything, the brands, the size, and all the information that you need in order to buy it. I just wanted to give you guys like a taste of what will be on there. So if you wanna go take a look, you can. Um, then I have these light colored, um, joggers jean joggers these were the first jean joggers that i did and then these kind of hurt my heart when i saw them in the bucket but i can't fit them anymore they're too big for me um but these are these jeans you guys remember these when i add the um the leather and the patches to these jeans i really like these jeans i'm gonna have to do another pair um and i really like how soft they are they're really comfortable to wear and then these also too i was um upset to see these in there but these are Calvin Klein but I did um, a heart shape distressing on both the knees so um, that's that and then I have a pair of green like a dark green olive green tweed um, culottes or short pants they are lined so they're really good for the winter time they kind of flare out a little bit um, they're just, I love these. I wouldn't be giving these away except they're too big for me. And I have these Riders Relax Fit. These are um, mom jeans and they are distressed a bit. And they kind of a little bit tapered at the ankle. I don't know if you guys can see it. At the ankle. Then I have my blue jean skirt um that i'm selling this is what is this this is ralph lauren the ralph lauren skirt and it is just a little bit distressed and also it's tapered i tapered it in took it in so it fits better on the body but it still has yeah it still has the split and then I have these Bugle Boy overalls, which I said I was gonna try this trend, but I chickened out. I just did. So <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and sell these um, so you guys can check that out. And then the last two items are two pair of shoes. I'm gonna go ahead and sell these. And I know you guys just saw these, but um, these suede brown um, kind of even know what you call these loafers and also the last the very last thing are these jelly um kind of Birkenstock S style um shoes and I thought these were really cool and I still think they're really cool except I don't go out without socks I don't stay in the house without socks so I was fooling myself and I do that from time to time if I see something for cheap enough so I'm gonna try to get better at that but that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, by no means, you know, am I 
trying to like force anybody to buy anything but i just wanted to let you guys know that this stuff will be over there um just in case you want to take a look so i appreciate you guys so much for all your support of my channel for everything every comment every everything that you guys do for just watching even if you don't comment for watching for subscribing i appreciate you guys thank you guys so much and i will um if you have not subscribed please subscribe and definitely you know if you uh, choose to go check out my depot page and you know bye and um i'll see you guys soon bye